prayer meeting na po tayo. I invite everyone. Punta po tayo sa harap. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I-occupy po natin yung mga upuan sa harap. Nandito po si Lord sa harap. Hallelujah. Malamig po sa harap, pero mainit po sa prosensya ni Lord. Amen! Hallelujah! Pwede po bang umabante tayo? Come on, there's blessing in obedience. <laughs> Abante po tayo. Hallelujah! Sama-sama po tayong mainitan sa presence ni Lord. <laughs> amen, amen! Excited na po ba mag-worship? Praise God, praise God. Lahat po ba excited na mag-worship sa Lord? Amen. Patihin mo naman po yung nasa kanan mo. Sabihin mo, bless ka tonight. Kasi katabi mo ako. <laughs> Sabihin mo naman sa nasa likod mo, bless ako tonight. Kasi katabi kita. Hallelujah. Praise God. At kayo rin pong nasa online. Mag-declare po kayo ng blessing sa katabi nyo dahil kasama po namin kayo mag-worship. Amen. Come on, let's call the presence of the Holy Spirit to be in our midst. Before tayo mag-Holy Week, before tayo mag walay. let's be binded by the love of God, by the presence of the Holy Ghost. Come on, let's worship Him. Let's call His presence. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Rabba, mama, 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 Hallelujah, hallelujah, come on. Live your praise in this place. Let's worship the presence of the Holy Ghost in our midst. Yeah, yeah, yeah. to be in our midst. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whoa. Shakarabha, mama, mama, yeah. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rabha, mama, son. Rabha, mama, mama, yeah. Let me uh, read uh, a verse in the Bible po. Before po tayo mag-start. Sino po dito pumupunta ng prayer meeting? Kasi meron tayong mga uh, prayer request na gusto po nating ma-answer. Amen? This is the reason why we go here. Sabi po ng Romans 8.34 Jesus who is at the right hand of God is interceding for us. Amen? Si Jesus po Himself, Siya po ang nag intercede sa atin. So whatever it is na you're laying down at the feet of the cross tonight, God is answering it because Jesus intercedes for us. Amen? Can we give God our best clapping praise in this place? Come on, let's worship the King of Kings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Savior, 
redeemer lift to me from the miry clay almighty forever i will never be the same cause you came here
This is the air I breathe. Oh, this is the air I breathe. Your holy presence. This is my daily bread. Oh, this is my daily bread. Your very word spoken to me. Recently, I don't know about you, pero God recently he keep on impressing to my heart that Anna, lagi na lang how how you love me, how you love me, what you want to do for me. You forget my love for you. How about my love for you? How about what I did for you? Can you just bask in the truth that I love you so much and you don't have to do anything else because it is finished. I have done everything. You just have to dwell in that love. Tonight, can we make this our prayer tonight? That God, I'm desperate for you, God. That Lord, I am lost without you, Lord. Even kami, Lord, na nasa loob ng church, Lord. Sometimes we get lost, Lord God. <laughs> can we make this our prayer? Sing. And I I'm desperate for you And I
praise in this place. All power, dominion, glory and honor belongs to you, Jesus. This we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. Oh, thank you, Lord. Sino pumunta dito? Desperado, desperado kay Lord. Amen. You are in the right place. Sabi mo sa katabi mo, you are in the right place. Amen. Praise God. So, I will be sharing. Praise God. Nakabaan ako. I will be sharing, uh, magpapakilala po sa atin ang Panginoon ngayong gabi na isa sa isa, kanya, isa sa kanyang pangalan. Amen. That He is our Yahweh. Amen. So we will go to Exodus chapter 3 verse 13 to 15. So et, ito pong story habang pinaflash po sa screen, ito na po ang pagkakatawag ni Moses. Ang instruction po ng Panginoon sa kanya ay before that, syempre, ang nangyari, na-encounter ni Moses si Lord sa burning bush. A very personal encounter with God. Ikaw ba na-encounter mo na ba ang Panginoon? Amen, di ba? Every day, every day we encounter the Lord. So, ang nangyari is the angel of the Lord appeared to Moses in the burning bush in Mount Horeb. At ang God's commission to Moses is to deliver Israelites out of Egypt. So, meron siyang assignment na gagawin. Eto na, na-encounter na, na-receive niya na, may bago siyang identity in Christ. Ngayon, verse 13 tayo, laktaw lang tayo. Ang sabi, Then Moses said to God, Indeed, when I come to the children of Israel and say to them, The God of your fathers has sent me to you. And they say to me, What is his name? What shall I say to them? Eto na. Wow. Sito dito yung napadala na sa school, yung representative. Oy, ito sa sali natin to dun. O kaya sa opisina nyo, pinadala ka sa ibang bansa. Wow, di ba yung mga ganyan? Tapos tinanong ka, pagdating mo doon, sino nagpadala sa'yo dito? Sino nire-represent mo? Ah, eh sinabi mo, yung pinakamataas na ano, na boss nyo, yung may-ari ng kumpanya, yung principal nyo, maganda ang credential. Siyempre, pag tinong, ah, si Pastor Rachel nagpadala sa akin, kunyari, pinadala ako sa ROG, baka kay! All right. Eh syempre, hindi naman po ako pastor, no? Wala po tayong karga-karga. So pagpunta natin doon, sino nagpapunta sa iyo dito? Ay, syempre pag sinabi kong may credibility pa nga, ay pinadala po ako dito ng ROG Galleria. Ay, syempre sila maiiniwala talaga sila. Because you have that kind of name. You have that credibility. Yung pangalan na dinadala mo, may credibilidad. Yung, pan yung pangalan na daladala mo, makapangyarihan. Yung pangalan na kinikerry mo is no other than me but Jesus. So kapag pinadala ka, dapat hindi ka na na, ay, sino ba nagpadala sa akin dito? But you have that kind of confidence but because Ikaw ang pinadala ng Panginoon. And no other name but Jesus. So eto na. Tinanong na ang pangalan in verse 15. Uh, uh, yes, 14. Sorry po. Thank you. <laughs> and God said to Moses, I am who I am. Again, and God said to Moses, I am who I am. And he said, Thus, you shall say to the children of Israel, I am has sent me to you. Wow. Pinadala ko ng Panginoon. And I am means Yahweh. Yahweh. Creator God, He is Yahweh. 
the righteous son, he is Yahweh. Yun po yung pangalan na daladala ni Moses pabalik po ng Egypto para mapaalis ang mga Israelites out of Egypt. So, eto na. Kayo po ba, di ba tayo usually, kapag tayo, na, sa, hindi pa natin kilala what we do, nagpapakilala tayo. As a significant that we want to know that person. Di ba? Kunyari ako, hindi ko pa kalaw si Pastora Roslyn. Pastora oh, Roslyn, ako nga po pala si Nika. So it's a significant that we want to initiate a wonderful personal relationship to that person. And ganun po ang Panginoon. Kaya niya po ni-reveal yung pangalan niya na one of his name as Yahweh because he wants to have a personal relationship with you. Nothing but nothing but you ikaw. Gusto niya magkaroon ng personal relationship sa iyo. Ganun po ang Panginoon. And in my habang inaaral ko po to, bigla po sa akin ni-remind ng Panginoon that number one, that God will introduce and reveal Himself to us in a very personal manner. Ganun po ang Panginoon. Kung dati po, nakilala mo na siya bilang your Jehovah, Jireh, your provider. So, usang pangalan pa lang ko, napakalami pangalan ng Panginoon. So, ikaw, because God wants to have that kind of relationship, ang role po natin, ang job po natin, ang ating panalangin ay magkaro tayo din maging hunger and thirst for more of Him. Na hindi, hindi lang sapat sa yun, ay, kala ko yun, as Jehovah Jireh, provider ko yan eh. Eh, what's next? Hayaan mo ikaw maging hunger ka. Naku, Lord, gusto ko pang makilala ka. Sabi sa kanta, I'm desperate for you. I want to know you more. I want to seek you more. That's why this is my prayer. Na hindi lang sa pansakin na hanggang dito lang kita kilala. But gusto ko mas makilala kay pa kita ng lubusan. And that's our prayer for tonight. That we will never satisfy just one glimpse of characters of God. But all of Him, makilala mo siya. Na kapag makilala mo si God, ah, Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Rapha, Jehovah Nisi. Di ba? Ang daming pangalan ni Lord. Tapos isa, isa, lang panga, isa lang ang kalala natin. Pero ngayon si Lord, He wants to reveal Himself in a very personal level. At ang role po natin, mas kilalanin pa siya. Kasi po ang Panginoon, hindi po niya, ka, hindi, willing siya. Willing siyang ipakiyala kung sino siya. Ang tanong, ikaw po ba? Gusto po bang makilala pa siya ng lubusan? Grabe, no? Nakaka Sobra po akong pinakilig ng Panginoon habang inaaral ko to. At dahil na-reveal niya ang sarili niya sa iyo at mas lalo ka nagiging hunger sa kanya, ang next nating role is to God, we, we want God to be known to, of all people na kilala natin. Paano yun, ate? Sabi niya kanina, ano sabihin ko na pangalan pag pinadala ko dun? The name is Yahweh. And we will be known to our family na may sakit that you, you need God who heals. Ire-represent ko ng maayos sa'yo ang Panginoon that He is the God who heals. Sa so, makaklase mo who doesn't know Jesus yet, dahil ikaw, nakareceive ka ng salvation, na-redeem ka, ipapakilala mo sa, sa mga kaklase mo that He is the God who redeem, That He is the God who saves. And that would be our prayer. Let it be known. Sabi kayo na sa kanta, isisigaw sa buong mundo. And let it be known to your campus. Let it be known to your community. Let it be known to your workplace that He is the God who saves. And that's our prayer, continuous prayer po natin yun. Let it be God be known. Siya yung star. Siya lang yung bida. Siya lang yung makakakuha ng glory. You're just a vessel. You're just a vessel of God. Because you know and understood that you be, have been saved. Marerepresent po siya very well kung saan kanya dinadala. Na hindi ka na magtataka na, ay sino bang pangalang kinikerry ko? Kasi kilala mo na nga eh, meron ka ng personal relationship. So when you go there, pag, pag labas mo pa lang ng pinto, pag welcome pa lang sa'yo, ay, may Jesus to. 
Sure ka may Jesus to. Pupunta ka sa outreach, aba, pag magde-deliverance, maraming may sakit, maraming um, karga-karga, aba, pag ganun mo palang, ay, may Jesus to, sigurado ko. Diba? Asaya kaya po nun, alam mo, just a little bit of story. Yan, doon po ako sa Bakakay, doon po sa isang bahay, meron na talagang isang, ibang spirito. Pero dahil naintindihan ko po, ang um, relasyon ko sa Panginoon that I have the authority, I have identity in Christ, din, din, dinala ko ng Panginoon doon, I will represent Him well. So that these people, this family, makikilala nila ang Panginoon. And praise be unto God, nung pinag-pray po namin yung may sakit at yung mga, uh, 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 usap po kasi doon yung mga witchcraft, yung may karga-karga, When we pray for them, umalis po ang masamang spirito. Napatanggap po natin yung mga kapatiran roon. Hindi po na Kaya nga sabi na, amiss ako, God will not always, you know, the pastors will be sent here, the, the, the names will be sent here, even you. Sabi ko ngayon, kasi nabi hunger dito and thirst for God, yung desperate sa Panginoon. Sabi niyo lahat kayo. And you can represent God very well because you have that personal relationship in, with Him. You don't have, no, yung mga titles, hindi mo na kailangan yan. Dahil kilala mo, dahil kagamit-gamit ka at nagpapagamit ka sa Panginoon, you will be sent out to your family, campus, out, uh, community, in your workplace. Hallelujah! And in verse 15, uy, hindi ko pang time. <laughs> In verse 15, sabi po dito, Moreover, God said to Moses that you shall say to the children of Israel, the Lord God of your fathers, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob has sent me to you. This is my name forever and this is my memorial to all generations. Grabe yung pinapaalala sa atin, no? In point number three ko po, that God will be remembered throughout generations. Grabe, no? Kung ako, henerasyon ko, sineran ako sa PUP, ito yung pagkakakilala ko. Ngayon, next generation, mga disciples ko, sineran ko. Ipapakilala ko sa kanila na may Diyos na namatay para sa kanila, na resurrect para sa kanila at muling babalik para sa kanila sa ating lahat. Nalala ko nga, full gospel. Akala ko dati hanggang resurrection lang. Walang ascension, walang pagbabalik ni Lord. Pero when you explain, because we have a future hope, may babalik na Kristo para sa ating lahat, sa mga taong eagerly and seeking Him. Are we eagerly seeking Him? Amen. Praise God. No, ito po yung ma ibibigay natin sa kanila. Let us remember God throughout generations. At sinabi pa po dito, Diyos po ng, nila Abraham, Diyos po nila Isaac, and Diyos po ni, nila Jacob. Si, ang Panginoon po ba sa mga tatlong henerasyon na yan, hindi naman nagbaliw ang Panginoon sa kanila. Sa henerasyon pa kaya natin, magmamaliw ang Panginoon? Ay, magmamaliw, ano ba gayon? <laughs> Magbabago ba? Di ba? Hindi. The same God that we served before is the same God that we will serve now and forever. Hindi po nagbabago ang Panginoon. Tayo lang po talaga yun, paminsan. <laughs> Pag nanadad, nadada pa. And in this verse po, This is a wonderful um, encouragement to all of us that we will never, wag po natin kakalimutan na yung mga henerasyon before, ngayon, at sa mga susunod, that we will never forget God. Kapag na, nakuha natin, we're is eagerly praying, di ba? Lagi tayo pray, 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 Lord, we want breakthrough, we want ganto, we want healing. And when the time comes, That the Lord give it all your prayer requests. Do not forget God. Bagkus, remember God 
throughout generations. Malala po natin lagi ang Panginoon na siya yung, wala naman talaga tayong maiyayabang i. Eh. Lahat naman ng pangangailangan natin, unang-una alam na kagayad yan ni Lord. You know why? Nung inaaral ko po ito, yung Yahweh pala, it's like a, it's like a breathing rhythm. Yah, you inhale, and we, you exhale. Even to your groaning, you speak the name of God. Even in your weeping season, you speak the name of God. Even in your laughing, you speak the name of God. Ibig sabihin, nung ka pala sa pag-ising mo, binabanggit mo na ang pangalan ng Panginoong Heso Kristo. At hindi, ibig sabihin nun, even to your most silent battle, God sees you. Alam niya yung pangangailangan mo, alam niya yung pinagpe-pray mo, alam niya yung parang unti na lang eh. Mabibi- Ito na yung breakthrough mo. Alam niya yun. He knows the very, I- yung buong ikaw. And all you have to do is to trust the Almighty God, the God of all creations, the God of... I- Abraham, Isaac of Jacob, throughout this generation, di naman nagbago ang Panginoon sa kanila. All the more, meron tayong karga-karga na promise. Ah, si Lord, galto yan before. Ah, may assurance ako. May confidence ako na gagawin din ito ni Lord sa generation ko. Sa buhay ko, sa pamilya ko, sa trabaho ko, sa campus ko, sa dinadamdam kong sakit, hindi nagbago ang Panginoon. Hallelujah. I just want to share a little bit of testimony. At, ayan, pal, abot ako, abot ako. So I just want to share a little bit of testimony. Tapos na po yung pointer natin. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. That the God, lagi po natin tandaga, tandaan that God will introduce Himself personally and we will make known God wherever we go and we will remember God throughout generations. Diba po? So, a little bit of testimony. So, anang nangyari po, baka nanod ang mga taga-bakakay. <laughs> anang nangyari po is, um, before po ako, alis po kasi kami bukas ni Oliver, and praise be unto God, dahil ginagamit po tayo ng Panginoon sa River of God Bakakay. So, anang nangyari po, bago po nangyari yung etong alis kami, Nag-initiate na po talaga ako kasi parang gusto ko makasama sila sa anniversary nila. It, second anniversary nil, po nila sa March 31. So nagpalawa kay Pastor Raki, sabi ko, ay, gusto ko dumalaw, dalaw. <laughs> dadalaw po tayo, wala po tayong role, dadalaw lang. <laughs> Tapos ngayon, pinagpaalan, hindi magpaalam ka kay Pastor Rose at saka Pastor Rachel para maayos ang ano, hierarchy. Ito na, nagpaalam ako Pastora Roslyn. Ganun po, lagi po paalala sa akin. Pastora Kiss. <laughs> lagi niya paalala sa akin yan na wag akong do not go against your leaders. Do, wag kang lalagpas. Lagi yan, hierarchy. Okay, nakapasa na tayo sa discipler. Uh, pastoral care. Ito na, kay Pastora Rachel. Pastora, gusto ko po pumunta sa ROG Bakakay kasi second anniversary po nila. Tapos, ah, really? The, 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 really? Okay. <laughs> okay, ganarn. Tapos, sabi ko, um, wala, wala akong sinabing road, basta dadalaw lang po talaga ako. The next thing I know, pinayagan ako. Tapos sabi ko, naghahanap ako ng team. Tapos sabi ko, ay, walang team. Ganyan kasi. Tapos nangyari, tinanong na kami ng taga-bakakay. Pastora, ma, ma pala kay Pastora Arosid, ma, May papadala po ba kayong speaker, pastor? Ay, hindi na may masabi na hindi pastor yung may papadala. <laughs> hindi na may masabi, ako lang po. <laughs> Me, myself, and I. Ganun lang. <laughs> Oo, yun lang. Pero nung, siya pinagadrama ako na, hala, hindi naman ako pastor. Anong gagawin ko ron? Ganun. Siya nagdrama na naman ako. And praise be unto God, <laughs> in my most kadramahan moment, Nagpakilala po ang Panginoon sa akin. That, sino papadala ko? Ikaw. Ikaw. So, ting- tingnan mo yung katabi mo. Sabi mo, ikaw. <laughs> sino kagamit-gamit? Ikaw. 
Sino yung nagpapagamit? Ikaw. Sino yung, sabi nga sa faith, di ba, sa discipleship team, sino yung available, sino yung teachable, sino yung hungry. Sabi mo sa nakatabi mo, ikaw. Amen. So, ikaw, wala nang iba. Kasi nakita ng Panginoon pagkatao mo. Alam niya yung disenyo mo. Alam niya yung pagkakagawa niya sa'yo. So, do not question yourselves. Kasi talaga, na- nangusap sa akin tong kwento na to. Kasi pinagdudahan ko yung identity ko. But because of the greatness of God, of the God who is in control, the God who answers prayers, the God of my God and the God of all generations, nakakatayo po tayo dito, not because we can, but because all about God's grace. Yun nang wala naman na tayong maiyayabang sa Panginoon. So I have one minute. And praise be unto God. Thank you, Lord, for your word. Thank you, River of God, for allowing me to share this passage. And I pray that all of our prayers, si Lord lang ang nakakaalam nito. And we all you have to do is bow down and surrender it all to God. So praise be unto God po. Come on, let's all stand up. Let's worship God before we pray. Lord, your name is so beautiful, God. Lord, your name is so beautiful, God. And we pray, Lord, that wherever we go, we represent your name well, Lord. We will be a good ambassador of your name, God, because it's the name above all names. What a beautiful name that you have, God. It's our desire, Lord God, to bring your name all over the nations, God. What a beautiful name it is. What a beautiful name it is. The
of your name in this place. All glory belongs to you, Lord. Hallelujah. 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 All glory and honor to you, Abba Father, God in heaven. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You deserve the highest praise and adoration, O oh God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh, you can uh, pray uh, personal prayers, Bo, and uh, hallelujah. Lord, we thank you for this night, Lord. Thank you for your presence, Lord. O oh, Holy Spirit, we welcome you. We love you. We praise you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are just lifting up to you every family here, every family represented here, Father God, Lord. You know our long-standing prayers, our heart's desire, Father God, Lord. Father God, we just believe, Lord, that you have answered our prayers, Father God, Lord. For those who are need healing, Father God, Lord, we believe that kami po ay pinagaling mo na, Panginoon. Sa mga anumang sakit at karamdaman, Panginoon, we are claiming the Isaiah 53, 5, Lord, that by your wounds, by your wounds, Lord Jesus Christ, we are healed, Papa Father. Thank you, thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let us pray for the body of Christ. Let us speak it in tongues. Let's open our mouths and declare God is the God of His church. Hallelujah. 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 Lord, we pray, God, for the body of Christ, God. Lord, we pray for holiness, God. We pray for repentance, love, humility, unity, righteousness, intimacy, outpouring of the Holy Spirit, and signs, wonders, and miracles, God. Lord, the langin namin, God, we will not go against your leading of the Holy Spirit, but all the more, Lord God, we will follow you, obey you, God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Father God, kami po ay uh, nananalangin para sa aming bansang Pilipinas, Panginoon. Lord, we are lifting up to you. Ang aming bansa. Lord, may you uh, salvation, Lord, come to all the Filipino people, Father God. We pray for the government officials, Lord, mula sa aming presidente, down to the barangay level, Lord. We pray for your guidance, for the salvation of all those elected officials and appointed officials, Lord. We pray for our economy, Father God, Lord. Lord, dalangin namin ang bansang ito, Panginoon, ay hindi na manghutang, kundi kami pa magpapahiram at magpapagbibless sa ibang mga bansa, Panginoon. And let your protection for this country from foreign invasion, O God. And we pray that you will over this country, Lord, against wars and calamities. And of course, Lord, can you prophetic destiny, Father God, Lord, that lahat po ng mga Christian churches, Lord, a, a missionary sending nation, O oh God, and let there be revival and awakening, Father God, Lord. And we will be the richest nation in Southeast Asia for the gospel before Jesus returns. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Let's continue to pray for the river of God. Hallelujah. Lord, we pray, Lord God, for every daughter churches, affiliates, God, the river of God, Galleria, in its ministries, God. Lord, we pray, Lord God, that this church, Lord God, we will move, Lord God, in your prophetic word, Lord God, for us, Lord God. Lord, we pray for covering, Lord God, for our spiritual parents, Bishop, Chita, and Pastor Rachel, and to all pastors and leaders, God. Lord, may you anoint them powerfully, Lord God. Lord, as they preach your word, as they powerfully share your word, let there be anointing from the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Lord God. Lord, empower every pastor's leaders of this church, Lord God. May we duplicate, Lord May we represent you well. Hallelujah. 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 And Father God, we are lifting up to you, Lord, ang river of God for Shangri-La, Lord. We pray, Lord, your provisions for the construction and your equipment for the new sanctuary for the river of God in Shangri-La Plaza here in Ortigas, Panginoon. Lord, we just thank you 
Lord, ngayon pa lamang kami po yung nagpapasalamat na because you have provided everything, Lord, for this place, for this sanctuary, Lord. And many souls, Panginoon, ay uh, masasave, Lord, uh, sa sanctuary ito. Maraming magpunta ang mga kaluluwa, Panginoon, that they will know Jesus and accept Lord Jesus as their Lord and their Savior. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lord, we pray, Lord God, for every service ministries. If you are a part for, of every serving ministries, let, it, let the power of God be with the, the discipleship and connect, ushering, worship team, media and production, communication, creative arts, missions, pastoral care and counseling, admin and river Bible Institute. Lord, we pray, Lord God, that this all serving ministry, God, all the more we want to serve you, God, with all the glory, God. Lord, magigagamit kami, kami, Panginoon, Lord God, to serve you, God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Father God, we are also lifting up to you yung uh, life stages, Lord, uh, starting with the river kids, Father God, Lord, um, river youth, um, young adults, men and women, river families, season fellowship groups, Lord, we just pray for those leaders na nagahandle ng mga groups na to, Lord, that you will continue to anoint them, give them the wisdom, Panginoon, and knowledge in everything na, na kailangan nila for this uh, uh, groups, Lord God, ay lalong lumago at lalong dumami, Panginoon, ang, ang lahat ng mga uh, nag-join sa life, uh, life stages na ito, Panginoon. Salamat, Lord God, salamat. Lord, we also pray for River, School, River Spring School. Lord, we pray for teachers. Lord God, sa lahat, Lord God, ng mga teachers, pang, Panginoon, we pray, Lord God, that let there be godly standards ang maituro, Panginoon, sa mga estudyante, Panginoon. Lord, we pray for open doors to the gospel to be preached, Lord God, sa River Spring School. Lord, we pray, Lord God, for every families, Lord God, provisions, Lord God, sa mga tuition fees, Panginoon. Lord, we pray, Lord God, Lord, for the funds for the... Uh, school year 2023 to 2024, God, to provide for the needs of the student and the school, Lord God. Lord, we pray, Lord God, for your provision, for your overflow, God, sa skwela hang ito, Panginoon. Lord, gabitin mo tong school na to, itong pamilyang ito, Panginoon, para lalo kang maihayag, Panginoon. Hallelujah. Father God, marami maraming salamat, Lord, that you are you continuously using the reader of God, a blessed to be a blessing sa mga street feedings and evangelism, lalo na ito po sa lugar ng Paco, na nagbuhatan, and all the other places, Panginoon, na na-reach out ng river of God. Lord, may continue to bless this ministry, Panginoon. Salamat, salamat po, in Jesus' name. Hallelujah, Lord! Salamat, Lord, sa Rift, ROG Kingdom Businesses. Lord, salamat sa ito, open mong mga business, Panginoon. Salamat sa mga Krisyano na gerais ang Panginoon para may bigay sa iyong kalawalhatian, Panginoon. Lord, we pray, God, that all of them, Panginoon, Lord God, business man, Panginoon, who will, will, Lord God, good steward, be, be a good steward of your blessing, of your money, Panginoon. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Yeah. Again, Father God, we are prayer for revival. Revival Hallelujah. in the seven continents, Asia, Europe, North America, South America, Oceania, and Africa, Lord. Let there be revival in these continents, Lord God. Let Jesus be God, the King of these places, O oh God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Salamat, Lord. Um, hindi lamang dito activate sa Pilipinas, Lord, but also in London, Lord. Thank you for the activate in London, Lord God. 
Lord, we just thank you, Lord, in advance. Magaganap sa lugar ng London, Lord. Let your anointing flow sa lugar na yon, ang mga um, pastors and speakers na gagamitin mo, Lord. Let the double portion of your anointing to be with them, O oh God. Let your mighty protection be upon them and traveling mercy. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord God. Thank you. Lord, we pray, Lord God, for TCEC and HIM, Panginoon. Thank you, Lord God. Ginagamit po to, Panginoon, para mag-send out revival sa bansang Pilipinas, sa bawat nasyon, Panginoon. Lord, we pray, Lord God, for every leader, Lord God, aparte niya to, Panginoon. Lord, let you give them God the wisdom. Lord, we pray for leadership, for equipping and empowering God. Thank you, Lord, to you all the glory, God. Hallelujah. Uh, stretch our hands uh, flag in Israel. Lord, we just thank you for this beloved country, Lord. Your, your chosen country, Lord. Chosen people, Lord. Salamat po, Panginoon. Continue to bless this country. Protect them against Hamas. Ano mga mga iba pa mga groups and other countries na gustong silayin ng bansang ito, Lord. Let your covering of your most precious blood be upon this country, Father God, Lord. Dalangin namin sa bawat Israelites, Lord na makilala kanila, Panginoong Yesus, at tanggapin kanila bilang Panginoon at Tagapagliktas. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. So, dada dadako na po tayo sa ating mga online prayer request na naka-flash po sa ating Facebook, sa screen. All right. So, kay Ate Cheryl Kagiwa, ang panalangin po niya ay please pray for the complete healing ng asthma nila Mark Daniel, CG at Geraldine Navarro. Complete healing din po ni Cherry Me. Healing ko din po sa pamamanhid ng mga paa at restoration din po ng kidneys ko. Thank you po. Tara po, sama-sama po tayong panalangin ang pamilya ni Cheryl, ni Cheryl Kagiwa. Lord, we pray, Lord God, for healing, Lord God. Sa anak ni po nila, Lord God, sa kay Mark Daniel, when it comes to their, sa asthma, Panginoon. Lord, Panginoon, any uh, abnormalities in breathing, Panginoon, we pray, Lord God, that you will normalize it in Jesus' name, God. Lord, we pray, Lord God, that you are the God who heals. And we will declare that she is healed by your name, O God. At dalangin din po namin, Panginoon, ng complete restoration, Panginoon, ng kidneys ni Cherry Me, God. Lord God, in ni Cheryl Kagiwa, Panginoon. Thank you, Lord God. So, by your stripes, she is healed in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. Okay. Okay. So, um, prayer from Claudette Celine Santiago Tohos. Prayer request healing for Peter Santiago from stage 4. I've been diagnosed with squamous cell carcinoma sa maxillary sinus. So, Father God, Lord, ano man ito, Panginoon, Lord, just we lift up to you si Peter Santiago, Panginoon, Lord. Lord, we just claim your promise, Lord, your, your word that by your wounds we are healed, Lord. So we declare for Peter for his complete healing, kahit stage 4 pa yan, Father God, Lord. We declare and decree His complete healing in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Galing naman po kay Pearl Baco. Please pray for church to cater for D Dr. Dor in Solomon Islands and Alin family in Arkansas, USA. Protection, healing, and salvation to these families in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, hallelujah. Lord, we pray, Lord God, uh, to Dr. Dor, Lord God, and Alin family, Panginoon, Lord God. Lord God, not just makahanap sila, Panginoon, ng church that they will cater them, but Lord, empower them, Lord God, to start an outreach, Lord God, in their places, God. To start in church planting, Panginoon, because you have said, Lord God, in your word, you give them the authority and power, God. So, Lord, we pray, Lord God, for their, uh, for protection, for good direction ang gagaling sa'yo, that you give them wisdom, kusan mo sila dinadala, Panginoon. So, thank you, Lord, even for the healing and salvation for the entire family, God. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. 
So, um, prayer from Light Labapi. Um, hi, ROG fam. Prayer po for my son, Bright, for complete healing po sa trangkaso and sa akin po skin allergy since last night. The Lord is our healer in Jesus' name. Yes, Lord, we believe, Lord, that uh, you are our Jehovah Rapa, Lord Jesus. We we pray for Bright, um, the son po ni uh, Pastor Light, for complete healing sa trangkaso and, and the skin allergy of um, Pastor Light. Lord, we... We claim healing for, for, for him and for his son and complete healing for his family in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Ayan. Kay Lord the Salud, I would like to thank God for continuous healing to my nieces Camille, Elaine, and Jamie Luz Salud Mercado, both diagnosed with escoliosis. Their mother will undergo shockwave for kidney stone. Lord, have mercy to them. Lord, we pray, Lord God, that you will strengthen the bones right now, Lord God. Lord, not just strengthen, but you will straighten. Lord God, itutuwid mo ang buto, Lord God, ng kanilang scoliosis, God. Lord, even, Lord God, yung mga abnormalities in healing, we pray, Lord God, that she can run, that she, itong tao ito, makakalakad pa rin, Panginoon. Every abnormalities, Lord God, sa upper body, Lord God, sa spinal column, Panginoon, that you will, the, you are the God who heals. You are the God na kaya mag-strengthen ng bones, Panginoon. Hallelujah. Lord, we pray, Lord God, sa kanilang nanay, Panginoon, na mag-undergo ng shockwave for kidney. Lord, we pray, Lord God, any operation, Panginoon, Lord God, we will make it successful. Lord God, gagamitin mo ang doktor, Lord God, to give them wisdom para, ma, Lord God, maging successful, Lord God, ang operation or any, any treatment, Panginoon. Lord, you are the God who uh, gives grace to your children. You are the God who gives mercy, God. You are being merciful, Panginoon. And we grasp in, Lord God, yung ganong klase ng Diyos na pagiging ikaw at yung pinapanalangin namin sa kanila, Panginoon. In Jesus' name. Prayer from Aimee Wardy. Uh, prayer for the brother of our brother in Christ, Anthony Francis Manyalak, his brother Edwin Sabilino Manyalak for emergency dialysis now because of the kidney failure at tubig sa puso. Lord, we are lifting up to you um, a brother in Christ, um, his, um, Anthony Francis Manyalak, and his brother Edwin Sabilino Manyalak for emergency dialysis now um, because of the kidney failure at tubig niya sa puso. Lord, ikaw po ang aming uh, great healer. Lord, we just pray for, for the, um, um, Francis Manyalak and Edwin for their complete healing. Um, Lord, yung dialysis na ginagawa, Panginoon, para sa taong ito, Lord, we just pray that this will um, uh, bring good effects sa kanya, Panginoon, and bring healing, complete healing, Lord, at maalis po yung tubig sa kanyang heart, O God. Salamat for the complete healing in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. From Gerald Gumin Kagiwa, prayer po healing kay Gabriel Dave Garbolos. Po, sa severe anemia niya at bone marrow po at si Auntie Gloria Retuya sa di diabetes po. Lord, nananalangin kami Lord God on behalf of Gabriel, uh, sa, kay Gabriel Dave Garbolo, Panginoon. This kind of severe anemia, Panginoon, and bone marrow, Panginoon. Lord, walang, hindi ibalit ang iyong kamay, Panginoon, para magpagaling, Panginoon. Lord, we pray for miraculous healing right now, Panginoon. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord God, may they receive your healing power, O God. Hallelujah. Even, Lord God, sa diabetes ni Glory Rituya, Panginoon. We pray, Lord God, any signs of abnormality sa pangangatawan, Panginoon, we rebuke it in Jesus' name. Lord God, we rebuke any lies of the enemy right now. Lord, you are the God who can... Heal, Lord God, every person in this room, Lord God, even online, God. So we, we grasp and we declare your healing power, God, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Uh, prayer from uh, Sister Belen Reyes. Please pray for my sister-in-law, Consuelo Acopan, who will be undergoing a lung transplant, left and right lungs in Canada. 
that the transplant will be a successful one, the lungs compatible with her. Father, we are lifting up to you, um, si Consuela Acopan, who will be undergoing a lung transplant, Lord, left and right lungs. Um, Doon po gagawin sa Canada, Lord God. Malayo man siya, Panginoon, Lord. Hindi malayo ang iyong kamay para siya abutin, Panginoon. And let there be a transplant maging successful, Panginoon, at yung lungs na ilalagay po sa kanya, Lord. We just pray that this will be compatible. Um, gamitin mo yung mga doktor, yung equipments and everything, yung mga medicines, Lord, that it will um, work fine sa kanyang katawan, Panginoon, oh God. We thank you, Lord, for the complete healing for Consuela Akupan in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Kirin, Kirino, please pray for deliverance and supernatural healing of my friend, Talia May, who has recently been diagnosed with schizophrenia. Schizophrenia. All right, so let's pray for deliverance and supernatural. Lord, hallelujah. Lord, we pray, Lord God, for your powerful healing flow inside the body of Talia May Panginoon. Lord, every uh, lie of the enemy, we command to come out, Lord God. In Jesus' name, Lord God, you're... kaya mo magpagaling, Panginoon. Hallelujah. Nahiniwala kami sa iyong pangalan na kaya magpagaling, Panginoon. Lord, this kind of disease, Lord God, mas malaki ang pangalan mo, Lord God, sa disease na to, Panginoon. At yun yung gagalawan, yun yung ipapamuhay ni Talia, may Lord God, that she is well, that she's been healed and delivered. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Um, prayer uh, from Pastor Tom Magisa. Receive a word of knowledge from the Lord. Anyone who suffers from any eye sickness and disease, the Lord is healing you. You will receive new sight in the physical and also in the spirit. I receive too. Those who are having traumas, allow the Lord to search your heart and let His healing move and operate to your heart. Salamat, Lord. We thank you. We claim this word. Yung promise mo, Lord, sa mga nagsasuffer from any eye sickness and diseases, Lord. The Lord is healing you right now and you will receive the new sight in the physical and also in the spirit. Salamat, salamat, Lord. Also for the trauma, Lord God. We, we lift up those uh, people, Lord God, na nakakaranas ng ganito, Father God, Lord, and let us allow the Lord to search our hearts and let His healing move and operate in our hearts. Salamat po in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. From Pastor Mark, praise report. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you for your prayers. You stage 5 kidney disease ni Pastora Resh Oblida. And Pastora Resh ay andito po. Hallelujah. Then rated to stage 3. No dialysis for, for her two weeks. For two weeks. And please continue to pray for her as... What's that? For his and supernatural healing in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Can we stretch our hands towards Pastor Reg? Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord, for your miraculous power, God. Hallelujah. We pray, Lord God, that hindi ito two weeks, God. Mawawala itong dialysis na ito, Panginoon. Lord, she is healed in Jesus' name. And we believe by the power of your name, she is healed, she is delivered, and she will testify that you are the God who heals, oh God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh, from Pastora, uh, Pastora Tin Soriano Corpus, please pray for healing for Cookie Reyes from cancer. Thank you and God bless. Father, we just lift up to you um, Cookie Reyes. Uh, siya po ay uh, diagnosed with a cancer, Lord. We just pray and lift up to you uh, ang aming kapatid na ito, Lord. Um, hindi po malayo ang iyong kamay, Panginoon, para siya abutin. Siya po ay pagalingin, Lord God. Lord, we claim your precious blood that was shed on the cross. Lord, you wash away all our sins, all the sickness and diseases. Thank you. We claim healing for Cookie Reyes in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. From Pastora Rachel, uh, the addition of ear infection be healed in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Lahat po ng mga 
May problema sa tenga pinagalingan ng Panginoon. Hallelujah. And isa pa, another vision of bleeding gums and pain sa mouth be healed in Jesus name. Hallelujah. Yung mga namamagang gums. Hallelujah. Pinagalingan ng Panginoon. Hallelujah. All right, hallelujah! Thank you, Lord God, for today and for tonight. Okay, hanap po tayo ng mga partner. Babae sa babae, lalaki sa lalaki. Yung mga hindi nyo pa po nakaka-partner. Yan, find your partner po. Okay, yung pong mga prayer request dyan, pwede po natin ipag-pray yan. Wala po sa ating puso. We really try to find time para ipagdasal yung mga pangalan na naririyan.
Lord, um, we know when we know that it's a yes and an amen, Lord, sa lahat ng pinagpe-pray namin ngayon, sa lahat ng prayer request namin, Panginoon. Salamat po dahil alam namin sinasagot mo to at sasagutin mo to. And we will wait patiently, O God, for the breakthrough in every areas of our lives. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Okay, ready na po ba tayo? I-share po yung vision na binigay sa atin ni Lord. Yung praise report na gusto nating ipagmalaki ang pangalan ni Lord. Sino po ba dito ang excited na mag-share? With power, with joy, with conviction, with love. Sino po ang gustong mauna at itaas ang pangalan ni Lord? I raise my hallelujah! Hallelujah talaga po, pinupuri ko at pinasasalamatan ng Panginoon. Ang prayer ko lang po, pupunta ako ng prayer meeting kahit meron po akong solution na dadalhin dito sa galeria. At dito ako mag, magdadialysis, pero kahapon sa check-up, sabi ng doktor, bumaba ang kreya mo. So, gawin na natin 8 hours ang interval. Habang siya nagkukomputer, ako po yung nagtatangs. Ah, siya gumagawa ng kanyang chart. O oh, sige, one week, ano na lang, one week, wala kang dialysis. Sige pa rin ako nagtatangs ako. Hallelujah, sabi ko, Lord. Yung, po, yung, yung one week na yun, nalaki na pong bagay yun sa akin. Until nag-final po siya sa pagtatype niya ng kanyang diagnosis. Two weeks po. Praise God. Two weeks po, wala akong dialysis and I'm claiming right now. Hindi na po ako magdadialis. Yeah! Woo! Yung sinabi po ni Pastor Mark, ang result po for two weeks na ako po ay after na opera, ngayon nag-laboratory. Sabi niya doon sa stage, sa aking pong discharge order sa hospital, stage, uh, final stage of uh, re renal failure. Five stage, fifth stage, and stage na po yun. Sabi ko doon sa diagnosis na yun. Ah, and stage na pala ito, Lord. For to me to live is Christ and to die is gain. Wala po ako naramdaman na depression. Sabi ko, Lord, my life is in you. Kailan mo kukunin? I'm ready. Pero hindi pa pala ako kukunin ni Lord. Hallelujah! May gagawin pa ang Lord sa buhay ko at sa buhay ng aking pamilya. To God be all the glory. Amen. Praise God. Sino gusto sumunod na excited din dyan? Hallelujah, come on! Huwag natin iuwi yan. I-share natin yan. Woo! Um, ano po, sa akin naman po, um, actually po, birthday ko po today. And, <laughs> ano po, ano po, thank you po. Ano po, um, ano po talaga, iniling ko po talaga kay Lord today. Yung pabunta pala ako ng prayer meeting, may expectation talaga ako. Sabi ko, Lord, yung pa-birthday mo na lang talaga sa akin, gusto ko talagang makakita ng maayos and makarinig ng maayos. Kasi po, I'm suffering for many years po about my eyes. Alam naman po yung nakaramihan. And also po yung sa ears, ear infection. Grabe si Lord kasi, mangyak-iyak ako yung nababanggit kanina, nakita si Pastor Tom ng eyes na nahinihil. Tapos kanina kay Pastor Rachel, yung ear infection, inaalis si Lord. I claim it talaga. Grabe talaga si Lord. So parang, Lord, thank you Lord kasi... Pa-birthday mo na talaga to sa akin, Lord. Salamat, Lord. Yun lang, yun lang naman po. Praise the Lord. Pag glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Baka meron pa. Huwag natin iuwi yan. Woo! Ay, wait lang po. <laughs> Teka, isa muna. Excited. Okay, go! Ayun. So, while we were praying po dun para po sa new sanctuary natin, the Lord impressed to me a vision po ng napakadaming fishes Parang swarm of fishes na biglang pumasok po sa loob na sobrang dami. And 
it's the Lord is really impressing to my heart that the Lord is going to, to do something new and something big dito po sa paparating nating na, na new sanctuary. And He impressed to me this verse, Matthew chapter 4, verse 19. Then He said to them, Follow me and I will make you fishers of men. So, may gagawin talaga si Lord na napakalaking bagay sa paparating po nating ano. All glory to Amen. God Amen. Hallelujah. Um, last week po, nagkaroon po ako ng ear infection sa tenga. Both ears po, nabasag po yung eardrum ko. Then, pinagpray po ako ng kapatid ko at ng mama niya, si Tita Amy po. And then, ngayon po, nag-improve na po siya. In the name of God. Thank you Praise po. God. Meron pa po ba? Praise God. Magandang gabi po sa lahat. Uh, ako po eh. Uh, namangha din sa Panginoon kasi uh, ang sa puso ko lang po sabi ko Lord kahit kahit uh, pagkatapos po ng ano ng uh, uh, yung ano ng doktor uh, pag check check up po kahit po three times a day lang po yung ano yung kasi po ang hirap po nung four times a day po na every six hours kailangan ko pong gumising kasi ako po yung magdada magdadayresis po ng misis ko at uh, Nakakatuwa po si Lord kasi noong pong tinitrain po ako na mag-dialysis po, mag po, pag mag po sa misis ko, kay Pastora Ridge po, training po, tinitrain po ako ng three days. Pero ang inatinan ko lang po talaga one day lang, eh, pinipilit po ako ng nurse at saka doktor po na mag na ako. Sabi ko, ah, ma'am hindi ko kaya yan kasi isang araw lang talaga yung, wala akong inaintindihan doon sa, ano, sa isang araw. Pinipilit po ako na, hindi, para makauwi na kayo. Sabi ko, siguro pinipilit kami para makauwi na. <laughs> Nagsasawa na sa amin. <laughs> Pero, uh, nung uh, nag-actual na po ako, nagkamali na po ako ng dalawa po. Pangalawa, hindi pa rin po ako pumasa. Pangatlo po, iniwan po kami ng, 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 ng nagtitrain po sa, nag, nagtitrainer po sa, sa akin. Pagka, pagbalik po niya, tapos na po kami. Sabi niya, bakit siya tinapos mo yan? Dapat na, nakita ko yan. Eh, hindi po din bukas mag ano ka pa uli. So pangapat po, praise God, nakapasa na po kami. Nakapasa na po ako. Kaya uh, to God be the glory po talaga. Ibang klase po talaga si Lord. Buhay na buhay po siya. Iba pala po yung, iba pala po yung ano eh, yung pong, yung pong alam mo lang, kasi actual po talaga, uh, yung uh, si Pastora po talaga, malakas ang loob niya. Sabi niya, hindi pagagalingan ako ni Lord. Sabi ko, Pero tamang-tama po kasi po nung umaga-umaga po na yun na bago po mag-check up, ang sabi po, ang, sabi, ang nabasa ko po doon sa message na sa Mark 11, 24, na pag ano man yung hilingin mo, paniwalaan mong natanggap mo na ito at tatanggapin mo ito. Sabi ko, Lord, salamat Panginoon sapagat buhay na buhay ka, binigyan mo ng katugunan yung panalangin ng marami. Siyempre po, mula po kina Bishop, dito po, mamri siya lahat po ng mga nandito, mga kasamahan po, to God be the glory sa lahat. Ang papuri po ay para lang sa kanya po. Last one. Um, praise report. <laughs> yeah. um, praise report lang po. Na-share ko po to ng uh, 10 a.m. service two weeks ago. So, yung iba po hindi narinig. I just want to give glory to God. But a lot of people here know that uh, my husband and I have been praying for uh, our new house or a new condo. So, one year po namin ni Luto in prayer. As in lahat yung loan and just everything else. And then, so nakalipot po kami af, like a, a, month and, a month and a half ago. And then, a month and a half ago, mga, siguro mga one week pa lang po kami nandun. The Lord woke me up at 5 a.m. Na-share ko to kay Pastor Rachel and kay Bishop. The Lord woke me up at 5 a.m. So, kala ko po naiihi lang ako. <laughs> so, nagbanyo ako. Nung nagbanyo ako, pagkaupo ko, kinusap ako ni Lord. Three times niya sinabi in Spanish. Bienvenida, bienvenida, bienvenida. So I have no idea what it means. So pagka balik ko po sa kama, ginugel ko po right away. Then, eksibihin po ng bienvenida in English, welcome. And then, specifically, alam niyo po yung doormat? Diba pagpapasok ko yung may welcome sa bahay. And then, nung research ko po in Tagalog, what bienvenida means, uh, maligayang pagdating sa aking bahay. So grabe yung, naiyak po talaga ako nung, na, kasi nung narinig ko yun, kasi the Lord was specifically tell, telling me. And 
Actually, ang proper po na pagsabi is bienvenido, which is for male. Pero sa akin po sinabi ni Lord. Yeah, bienvenida. So grabe po yung, yung pag-welcome sa amin ni Lord sa bago naming bahay. So praise God for that. And last one na, na praise report na ilang months na rin po namin pinagpipray mag-asawa. So my husband has been accepted to a new job. Praise God. So all glory to God for all the breakthroughs this March. Praise Lord. Uh, kanina sa intercession namin, uh, nakakita ko ng vision. Nakakita ko ng ahas. Nakastretch kaya lang. Nakaano siya, nakaklamp. Hindi makagalaw. Kasi nakaklamp. Pagkatapos, sinachop ng maliliit. So, ang, ang impression sa akin ng Panginoon, Because uh, our spiritual eyes are open, we see the... Uh, kasi ang enemy naman hindi tumitigil sa pag-atake, you know? Kaya lang, uh, because our spiritual eyes are open and we, we watch our lives before the Lord, ang kalaban di makalapit. Kaya parang nakaklamp siya, kumbaga, yung mga atake niya, powerless. Powerless. Pero siyempre, patuloy lang tayo sa ano sa sa intercession, patuloy tayo sa watching our lives before the Lord. Amen. And uh, now uh, I want to challenge you for our offering. Then we'll go to our street feeding, blessed to be a blessing, our street evangelism every Friday and Sunday in Pasig and in Manila. Amen. Come on, let's plant a seed in the kingdom of God. Okay, let's stretch out our hand. Lord, we thank you for giving us the opportunity to bless others, O oh God. Use this for the furtherance of your kingdom. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, we proceed to announcement. Announcement. Okay, soaking in the river, April 11 na po yan, 2024. 4 p.m. to 8 p.m. Dito lang po yan sa Victory Ortigas. See you all. Next. Okay, sa GIP Kalusugan po, meron po tayong pagkakataon para maging volunteer dito. Meron po tayong medical services dito. Libring general checkup, pagamut po. Libring dental checkup, pero may kasama din po yung libring bunot. Libring eye checkup, may libre din pong salamin yan. Tapos sa mga specialist po natin from Australia, psychiatrist, pediatrician, and OBGYN. April 29 to 30, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Doon po sa River Springs. So, so gustong mag-volunteer, handito lamang po ang ating uh, uh, si Nika Moreno po or si Jello Martin po para makapag-register tayo. I would like to invite every one of you to really partake. Next. Okay. Turkey Experience 2024. It's an opportunity para tayong lahat maka-attend dito. Seven churches of the Book of Revelation po. Wala po sa ating nakapunta pa dyan, kaya ini-invite po namin kayo to really pray for it. At bigay ni Lord sa atin. October 14, 225 po, 2024. Mas mahaba po ito. 12 days and 11 nights. Travel included. Registration fee is 2,800 US dollars lang po. Napakaliit po niyan para kay Lord. Kayang kaya. Kaya niya yan. Now, um, included na po dyan yung airfare and all. Okay, for more info, pwede niyo punta contactin si Pastor Mark Lebonau. May I call on uh, Nika? Ah, wait, meron pa pala. Discipleship Haddle, serving in ministry. April 6, 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. dito po sa River of God Center. That will be next week na po. 
Okay, okay. All right, can we all stand and receive the blessing? <laughs> all right, hallelujah. We thank you, God, for tonight, for every prayer uh, mo, Panginoon. And Lord, as we wait for our praise to be answered, Lord, help us to seek you more, to be desperate in your word, in your presence, God, that we will increase in faith, O oh God. Lord, this hand raised, God, we, may, we ask that, Lord, ingatan mo kami sa aming pag-uwi, Panginoon. And we go to our home with all of gratitude, Panginoon. Meron kami pusong ah, nananampalataya sa iyo, Panginoon. So we thank you, God, to you all the glory, honor, and praises in Jesus' name. 